Hi everybody, happy 4th of July and thanks for checking out the uh, Jackson Sun Sports Rundown for this July 4th, 2013. Um, a couple things that are uh, going on in the next uh, day or so. We've got some pretty cool stories for you to check out. Um, you know, one thing I definitely want you to check out, uh, the, today's paper we had a, a story on a, a man named James Davis uh, who's a assistant football coach over at Middleton. He uh, has been in the National Guard, a couple of, uh, has had a couple of deployments with the National Guard most recently to Afghanistan, getting back uh, to West Tennessee last month. Uh, Brandon Shields talked to him, and that's a pretty cool story. He's got a lot of uh, interesting stuff to tell, and that's definitely something, if you haven't seen it yet, um, get a paper or go online and check it out at jacksonsun.com. A, a really interesting story I think you'll enjoy. Um, we've got some cool stuff uh, for today and tomorrow as well. Um, last night, the uh, Jackson Journals had a huge crowd at their uh, baseball game with the Birmingham Barons. Uh, didn't work out so well on the field uh, the way the Generals intended. They lost that game 7-2, but uh, over 6,400 people, which is a big, big uh, crowd for the Generals. And uh, afterward, they had fireworks, of course. And um, on the on the field, the team, uh, a few of them, a few of the guys uh, got their heads shaved to raise uh, awareness and raise some funds for cancer patients. So definitely a pretty cool thing there. Uh, Josh Lemons uh, was out there. Uh, photographer Kenny Cummings were out, was out there as well. Um, they got some, some photos and some video and a in a story that, uh, you know, just talking to a couple of the guys about that. So that's pretty cool. That'll be our focal story for tomorrow. We already have a, a video online, so uh, that's uh, pretty cool. You can check it out see the guys getting their head uh, head shaved. I think they're um, having a lot of fun with it, so definitely something to check out. Brandon Shields will have a, another Dirty Dozen in tomorrow's paper. He's going to look at some of the top non-district high school football games um, for 2013. Uh, some some pretty good ones uh, involving lots of different schools from around the area, not uh, not just the same school or two by any stretches. A lot of, obviously a lot of good games that you know people throughout West Tennessee are playing before we even get into that district stuff um, later into the season. And just looking at the schedule is you know kind of getting me excited for uh, for football season because there's a lot of good ones for sure. Um, the high school football team that uh, we're previewing for tomorrow is Camden. I'm sure Brandon will be sending out some tweets today kind of about Camden and uh, you know what their outlook is for 2013. Um, but definitely some cool stuff to check out there. Um, other than that, we've got a little quick generals wrap up. We have some uh, some news that Brandon has from uh, a Jackson Central Mary assistant being named the head coach at Lake County. That's online now, so you can check that out. And uh, we'll have some information on baseball and, and Wimbledon and that sort of thing as well. So um, hope you're having a great 4th of July. Uh, stay safe, have a lot of fun, and check in with us tomorrow. Thanks very much.